Well, hello, my fellow YouTubers. Mr. Size 12 here with another video for you. Today we have a couple of topics. I would like to first touch on my first pickup ever for a Stefan Janowski Nike skateboarding shoe. And the second item I would like to touch on is specialty shoelaces, also known as lace swaps in the sneaker community. All right, let's get started. This is my first Stefan Janowski pickup. I uh, would have liked to have got a Lunar Stefan Janowski shoe for my first one because everything Lunar is amazingly comfortable for all y'all that do not have any Lunar Nike shoes out there. But I had to pull the trigger on this one because I'm a little older than most of the average sneaker enthusiast out there, so uh, I thought this one was pretty grown looking. Cop these from Premier, always cool. They uh, give you a little personalized touch. It says, Thanks, Kevin, on there. That is my real first name for those of y'all that do not know me out there in the YouTube community world, whatever. But, uh,. I went ahead and pre-laced the shoes with the lace swaps that I had in mind. I ordered two pairs of leather rope laces from Mates Brand. Uh, found them on Instagram and they had some pretty cool laces on there. So I went ahead and pulled the trigger before I was the day before these shoes came out. Came out on Saturday ordered these laces on a Friday and if anyone knows my sneaker habits I am a sucker for the animal print and these bad boys the obsidian crocs whatever people are calling them it's got that crocodile pattern in Boston that obsidian navy bluish color and went ahead and laced these up for my lace swaps a little bit of lace dust on these bad boys. Dust that off. But uh, went ahead with the tip color. Uh, leather. They're like square laces on there. And these were actually a pain in the ass to lace up properly. Not so much on this lace. Because it's almost the same exact color no matter what way you twist these here. But there is one dominantly smoothed out side to these laces. Uh, one critique of these laces, I think it would be nice if two of the opposite sides were finished. You've got the finished side here and the remaining three sides are all raw and fuzzy looking. And this especially applies to the other lace choice that I went with. This isn't so bad here because the color is pretty uniform and from any kind of distance you can't even tell. I experimented with a couple different ways of lacing this. I went with like a factory style type lacing here. Um, I'm thinking about chopping the laces a little shorter and uh, tying them traditionally. But anyway, this is a badass shoe right here and definitely worth being my first Janowski ever. I think uh, this could be dressed up to look like a dress shoe and the croc style embossed print that they have on here I think totally helps pull that look off and the other shoe and lace choice that I went with oh, got it right here not in the box is these freaking sweet ass gold laces now these were a pain in the ass trying to get these laced up so that you can see as much of the gold as possible because once you go to flip this over for the first lace, you have to twist them all crazy so that the gold is still showing up top. Otherwise, it would be any of these other three unfinished black sides. So, like you could see the black here pretty easily. Some extra flatties there, but uh, this is definitely the dressed up grown looking lace choice that I was looking for with these and the reason that I ordered these laces in the first place was for these gold laces so let me know what you guys think I know that the other lace choice this Tiffany lace choice goes good with the insole but 
who the hell can see the freaking insole when the shoe is on your damn foot? Also, another thing about these shoes is there's a suede sock liner on these things. And people are asking how soft the suede is. And I don't know. I think this is kind of bullshit suede that's the thinnest crap ever. It's pretty hard. I don't know. It feels like cardboard on the side here. Not really sure what is reinforcing this heel cup here. I don't know. I've never destroyed a Janowski. I've never owned a Janowski in the first place. But I don't know. It feels like cardboard in here. And that is what it feels like basically when you rub your fingers across this sock liner. There is no buttery feel to this whatsoever. It feels like you've already worn it and it's like matted down and all flat and everything. So this having a suede sock liner is of zero value to anyone for anyone was wondering about the suede in the sock liner. I think it is trash and is totally unnecessary and is, should not even be considered a feature because it is nothing special. I guess you got a little bit of color change. I don't, you can't see it really, but there is a very slight amount of color change with it, but nothing to write home about, nothing that feels great, and nothing special. So that's about all I have for you guys today. So if you have any input on these, let me know if you are liking the tiff colored laces or the gold laces if you can leave that down in the comments like comment subscribe all that good stuff that's all i have for you mr size 12 peace